A giant corpse weighing 60 tons mysteriously appeared on the seashore. He had exquisite facial features and a burly body. Nearby residents rushed over to watch. No one knew where he came from as the first person climbed onto the giant's body. More and more people began to follow suit. They frolicked and romped on the giant's body. Some even jumped ballet on his nose. Scientists on the hill frowned slightly watching all this. A few days later, people lost interest in the giant spectacle. Only a few children were left playing on the corpse. The nearby butcher and workers started discussing how to sell the corpse for a good price. Then a few more days passed. No one was left on the beach. The scientists climbed onto the giant's corpse for the first time. His face had begun to show signs of decay. His left arm had also been chopped off. Seabirds were pecking at the flesh on his body. A few weeks later, the giant was unrecognizable. An old man stood guard nearby, boiling several pots, not knowing what he was cooking. A few months later, people had gradually forgotten about the giant. Parts of its body began appearing in corners of the town. The thigh bone was stuck in the beach by the pier. The shin bone became a decoration at the meat shop entrance. Half a skull became a coast for a farmer, and some special parts were exhibited. Charging money for people to view.